Imagine struggling to fill your lungs with air and with each breath feeling like you're suffocating. That's what happens to more than 18 million Americans who suffer from asthma. Medications, shots, inhalers, and steroids help most people keep it under control, but for some, that's just not enough. Now there's a new drug that may get them breathing easier again. No matter what Roxanne McWilliams is doing, she always knows where her inhaler is. I may be outside and there's someone's cutting grass and then boom, there it is. For some, inhalers and steroids don't work. Now researchers at Washington University School of Medicine have found a new drug, rezalibumab, to prevent attacks from happening. It goes after the molecule that causes asthma. So the antibody is a, basically a protein in that injection that will bind up all those uh, molecules that are in your bloodstream and doesn't allow that um, molecule then to bind to your lung tissue, to bind to your windpipe, so it can't cause the inflammation. An injection once a month was given to hard to treat asthma patients. Their inflammation went down and they had a 50% reduction in severe asthma attacks. It takes some of our severe asthma patients from being really out of control to being well controlled. Compared to steroids, there are few side effects, just a risk of infection at the injection site. The downside, steroids work within two hours. The new drug takes two weeks to work. But Roxanne says it would be worth the wait. That ability to not have to think about it, to not have to worry, and to not have to have that threat of illness happen would just be so freeing. Doctors are hoping this new drug will be available within the next two years. A simple blood test will show who it will help and who it won't.